In the summer heat of Maysville, South Carolina in 1875, Samuel and Patsy McLeod gave birth to a young woman, Mary Jane McLeod. Mary had a passion for education and became a school teacher. During her early days as an educator, she began her steps into history. She began the movement for teaching young black women and giving them the same level of education as young white women. She marched through prejudice to create safe spaces for black communities and was president of the National Association of Colored Women. Through this, she began a relationship with the First Lady Eleanor Roosevelt. Her courage was never unnoticed as President Franklin Roosevelt even referred to her as the First Lady of the Struggle. Mary McLeod Bethune's footsteps carry strength to this day, inspiring young minds to stand the ground for equality and the right to learn.